Hey guys, it's Miraline, Delicious Delights. Welcome to my channel. Today's review is from the house of Byredo. This one is called Gypsy Water. So not too long ago, I reviewed Ball de Freak. That one was quite a surprise to me. I actually really enjoyed it and it kind of inspired me to pay more attention to this house. A lot of you guys in the comments suggested that I give Gypsy Water a try. And I also know it's quite popular in the community, but it's just not something that I, you know, was inclined to ever pay attention to. Uh, but anyways, I have been wearing Gypsy Water for the past week or week and a half. And you guys were totally right. This is an absolutely, gorgeous scent. I think I even like this one a little bit more than the Ball de Freak. Um, yeah, I'm even considering getting a bottle of this because it just, it's beautiful and it smells like something that I could wear every day. It is a signature scent worthy kind of perfume and um, I love it. So notes in uh, Gypsy Water, top notes are juniper, lemon, bergamot and pepper. Middle notes are pine needles, incense, and orris root. And then the base notes are sandalwood, vanilla, and amber. I have the dry down here, and then I'll just spray the strip for the uh, top notes here. I mean, it's, it's just gorgeous. <laughs> okay, so what does this smell like? In the opening, I get a creamy, creamy lemon, almost dessert gourmand kind of scent. Um, this lemon is mixed in with some sandalwood, which is also quite creamy to my nose. And there's also a sweetness to, to this from vanilla. So yeah, in the beginning, it's very gourmand, very warm, very smooth. And there's also a touch of spice in the top here, almost like a peppery spice and yeah, I was like wowed with this opening. It's just a gorgeous, gourmand, creamy lemon, um, and very smooth and almost like a silky texture. And yeah, as this fragrance dries, it gets even more interesting. Um, there's this beautiful incense note in here that I definitely pick up after about five minutes on my skin. It slowly turns into like a piney, smoky incense. And it starts to get even warmer on me. But at the same time, it's still fresh because of this lemon citrus bergamot note that keeps it uplifting and not too heavy. But then on the other hand, there is this like darker, um, soft, green, earthy incense smoke that uh yeah it's a very nice contrast and um smells amazing on me i, I i'm just telling you guys i really uh, was surprised by this on my skin here it smells so so good even better than it does on my clothing um, because of how this fragrance develops because you know after some hours on my skin I'm left with a woodsy vanilla incense. It is quite a faint scent, I will say. It's, it's, a, it's a skin scent. And for some people that uh, might be a deal breaker because it's not something that projects very loudly or, you know, maybe you have to be pretty close to, to smell it. Um, but if you're looking for something that you can wear every day that isn't very loud, that is very unique, um, inoffensive, something for the office perhaps, um, then this one you should give a try because for me, it's something that I can wear for all occasions. It's just an easy going, beautiful, unique niche perfume that um, I, as I said, I, I absolutely love this one. So yeah, this is amazing. <laughs> Thank you guys so much for suggesting this and yeah i would love to hear your opinion on gypsy water by by Rado. so there are other ones from this house that i'm definitely going to explore uh, but yeah this one is definitely a winner two thumbs up i i think this is my favorite of the house so far 
it's just wonderful. <laughs> so that was my quick review of Gypsy Water from Byredo. Thank you guys so much for tuning in and I'll see you guys soon in the next video. Take care. Bye-bye.